Hey there, Air Signs. Welcome to your reading for the week of September 9th. Uh, this week, if you want to catch me live, make sure to go down below and uh, subscribe. Hit the bell notification icon. I go live every single day at 4 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. Also, uh, this week and next week, I'm going to be mixing all the signs together. I got a lot going on. <laughs> got a lot of stuff to take care of in my life. So uh, for, for right now, we are going to be mixing these readings together until uh, probably the end of the month when I have uh, everything all set up. It, it'll all make sense in the future but right now it doesn't make sense but just know I got a lot going on and uh, so I have to mix everything together but anyway enough excuses let's get this show on the road here cards are flying all over the place today so uh, your overall energy is a three cups just feeling good uh, is kind of what I'm getting off of this um, so I feel like some of you are just feeling good this week spending a lot of time socializing with friends and all that other stuff as well so uh, just good feelings for you air signs this week and a lot of happiness a very good card for friends and all that other stuff so I really like to see this uh, here for you so really good uh, you start with the queen of clubs here coming up in the first position queen of clubs is just a card of being very attractive at this time air sign so again get out there could be a lot of love coming in for you this is also a card of like needing to get attention and also a card of being like assertive as well. So if you're like trying to get a raise or a promotion at work or whatever, this card says try to stand out as much as possible and you could get a raise or promotion at work. Uh, next you have the four of diamonds. This is a card of patience. So some of you could be working towards building more financial security in your life with the four of diamonds. And it's just like a card that says it is coming, but just in the future. So it just says keep doing whatever it is you're doing. Keep working on whatever it is you're working on at this this time and it's going to lead to something more secure this is also the card of your soulmate coming in in the future literally one of the meanings of the four of diamonds is saying that your soulmate is coming in but it's going to be in the future uh, it could also say that you are with your soulmate but maybe you're hoping for a deeper commitment and it can say just be patient that commitment is coming um you know and it's just coming in in the future as well so uh, definitely a very good card for love uh, it could also be moving as well i do feel like some of you have two fours here so some of you could be moving or traveling what i would say is it looks like there are delays um you have the four of hearts coming up in your challenge position it could just say that there are delays to um, moving because of this. This could also represent a long-distance relationship. I think this comes up for Gemini all the time, but I think it comes up for all uh, air signs that there could be like a long-distance relationship coming in if you're not already in one. And if you're in a long-distance relationship, it's just saying you just have to be patient. Things are going to work out, but it's just going to take a little bit of time. Uh, next, you have the Two of Clubs here. Two of Clubs is a card of communication, so it just says keep communication open with everybody around you. But it's also a card of convincing yourself of something. I do feel like a lot of you could be needing to convince yourself of something here. Um, this is like a card of uh, self-motivation. It's like a card of saying maybe you want to start a business or start a new job, but maybe you don't feel qualified. This is a card of like needing to talk yourself into it. So I feel like some of you need to talk yourself into something, especially financially. Uh, I feel like this is mostly talking about business and things like that with this card. Next in your challenge position, you have the Four of Hearts and Nine of Diamonds. Some of you could be having a hard time letting the past go in a relationship here coming up in the challenge position. Nine of Diamonds is called the Coffin, and it represents needing to let something from the past die, needing to let it go. The Nine of Diamonds, when there is a coffin on this card, the coffin door is closed. It says, it is time for you to open that coffin door and start a new life. It is time for you to start something new. Four of Hearts, I feel like it could be talking about unnecessary delays. So some of you, I feel like you, like especially in love, Number one, I'm getting like multiple stories here, air signs. I feel like for some of you, it's like saying, if you want love, you could have it already, and you just need to let the past go. You'll have new love. Uh, Four of Hearts is a really good card for love. Um, and again, actually, as far as a challenge is concerned, this is not that big of a deal. This is not a very difficult challenge that we have going on here. Um, these are actually both very good cards, so you know things could be going very well. Uh, same thing with moving as well. It's like some of you, you might feel stuck in work or business. And this is saying that there just needs to be some sort of move in work or business. Maybe you need to go get another job. Maybe you need to ask for a raise or a promotion. That could be a move. You know, it's like you moving up in a business. Or maybe you literally need to move. This could say that maybe you need to move locations or change. Uh, maybe you need to move to another state or country or what you know, whatever it is that you're thinking about. I'm also getting, I'm getting, like I said, a million things here, Air Signs. I feel like for some of you, this is also talking about long distances as well. So if you are in business or if you have a job that involves like other countries or, you know, other places, I feel uh, like there could be a lot of opportunity in 
doing something like at, in other places and other countries and things like that for others i feel like that something needs to move forward a little bit quicker like if you are in a relationship but if you are kind of like if it's like slow or if things are moving forward slower i feel like things could move forward a lot faster um i feel like your fears of the past uh, could be holding you back that's what's popping into my head so Again, maybe you're in a relationship, maybe you're taking it really slow, uh, which is fine, but at the same time, I feel like, you know, it could move forward a little bit faster, and uh, again, the fears, uh, what's popping up in my head is like saying, is basically saying, you know, don't let this relationship, especially if it's a good one, disappear. Four of diamonds, card of soulmates, four of hearts, card of marriage, so some of you could be, like, in a relationship that could be very significant, but it's like your fears of the past, nine of diamonds, are preventing you from allowing it to move forward faster, um, and again, it's not a speed thing, it's just saying, like, if this does doesn't move forward a little bit faster, I feel, uh, with these cards. Now, kind of a crazy message. I don't even know. Uh, I'm trying to get it to come through clear, but it's basically saying if it doesn't move forward a little bit faster, I feel like it's going to disappear. So don't allow that to happen. Uh, next in your solution position, you have the Seven of Clubs and the Queen of Diamonds. So again, it does look like Seven of Clubs is slow but steady progress in the solution position. It just says you are going to overcome these obstacles. So, you know, not much to say there. Any, uh, and also, this could be in love, business, whatever it is that you're doing. It's like you're overcoming obstacles. Queen of Pentacles, uh, I, for some reason, I'm getting like turning over a new leaf. So I feel like some of you could just be like starting over or kind of like turning over a new leaf here with the Queen of Diamonds. And I feel like it's going to be good for you. I also... I feel like this could be a new job or a new business coming in for those of you who need it. Uh, your outcome is the Jack of Diamonds and Seven of Hearts. Seven of Hearts is building a family with someone. Uh, it's a card called the tree, kind of like a family tree. And Jack of Diamonds could be new love. So again, I feel like all of you need to focus on new love if you don't have it already. Or, um, you know, again, if you are in a relationship, by the way, this is a very good combination. I'm not saying you have to leave your relationship. If you're in one, this is very good for building a family or have your kind of like deepening a commitment with somebody. Uh, this is also very good for work. Jack of Diamonds kind of is a funny card because it can represent the fear of money or not ha feeling like you don't have money but it could also represent good news coming in about money so some of you could be worried about money but it's like good news with these two cards is about to come in so it looks like a very good week for you i do feel like some of you need to move something along a little bit faster like i almost get i'm almost getting like the knight of pentacles here i feel like for some of you you could be being a little bit too cautious and it feels like love to me but it could be anything it could be business as well but i feel like if you're in a relationship or if you're in a relationship where there hasn't been like um you know maybe there's like kind of a commitment i feel like there needs to be a little bit faster movement here um for you is what i'd say especially if it's long distance with those two fours it's pretty weird um you know i'd say if it's too if it's long distance i feel like there needs to be more forward movement i don't even know what that means but uh that's what i would say to you so Thank you, Air Signs. Really appreciate it, but uh, thank you for watching and enjoy your week.